Welcome back everyone, Jim here. Well, this is uh, going to be a short, cute little video. It's April 16th. Oh, and it's probably, uh, well, let me see if I can see what time it is. Looks like it's about uh, 2.30 in the afternoon. And they've been telling us it's a Friday. And uh, they've been telling us that we had snow on the way, one of these late April storms. And the section I'm in, in Maine, and it, it, they said we'll get, you know, anywhere from two to four inches. Along the coast, they might get a dust in two inches. And in the mountains, as much as four to seven inches. Well, I just thought it'd be a kick to, it just started here a while ago. I'm not sure, it could end any time. Um, but here's what we have on the lawn. Isn't it pretty? And you can see the, the driveway. Now the ground's still pretty, it's, it's softened up, the frost is gone. So it won't last long. But uh, if it snows hard enough, it will build up. It will just melt fast. And you can see we had flowers coming up. And like I said, this uh, this won't last long. But it's uh, something that usually happens in April. In some of my films, I've been saying... Uh, you know, it's not over till it's over, and there'll be some sort of late storm. Well, this is a late storm. Might not get over till tomorrow. It always amazes me how, uh, how easily things can go from grass turning green to uh, everything being snow-covered. It's these uh, kind of storms that uh, make people say, isn't it pretty? <laughs> uh, and it's easy to say, isn't it pretty? I mean, we know this is more than likely will be the last storm of the 2020-2021 uh, season. It's amazing because I can still hear the birds off in the distance. It's a lot of birds, new birds. I haven't heard frogs yet, but uh, yeah. So I'm gonna I'm gonna leave it here until the storm is over. So perhaps uh, tomorrow, if I can catch it before much of it melts, I'll show you what we finally ended up with. Okay, folks, so here we are on the morning of the 17th, and uh, it's about, it's 7 o'clock here in Litchfield. Uh, the temperature is about 33 degrees. It's still, well, kind of rainy, spitting snow a little bit. Uh, but for the 17th, this is, I don't know, I think it's later than the storm we had last year. But it's nice to keep a little record of, uh, you know, each year when our last storm was. And I do feel this was probably our last uh, significant uh, snow event uh, for this season. So, there's still a little bit of snow left on the tire of the camper. But you can see every place else, the ground was just too warm. It never really got below freezing I don't think during the night but it was the upper air atmosphere that was uh, so cold that uh, it put out uh, snow in the upper atmosphere and this warm weather down close to the ground just couldn't overcome it so that's why the snow built up. Let me take a look out back. Even out back 
There's still a little bit of remnants of the snow on the ground, but pretty, uh, pretty insignificant. And there's still a little bit left on the deck. Well, it is, like I said, about 33 degrees. So, uh, this snow will be here for, oh, through the mid-morning anyway, what's, what's left. Looking at the grass, though, another couple weeks and I'll be mowing. You can hear all the birds coming to life. It's pretty. All right, so uh, so much. So much for this update in Litchfield. Uh, I'll be back at you with more films. But uh, this one I like to record, if I can, a few dates in history so that later on we can see how late it snowed. Thanks for coming along. Hope you enjoyed.